Lord Sakai. Genji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing. The Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where are the Mongols camped? Who knows? They show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. If we don't produce the food, it's... There must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. Come, I'll show you. They make us bundle the food and put it on the beach. All of it from this farm? The farm, scavenging abandoned homes, fishing and hunting, just to fill the bellies of the enemy. What brought you here in the first place? Once the Mongols connected me to you, most places got too dangerous. I thought an out-of-the-way farm would be safer. Food and drink for the Mongols. But the sake barrel is empty. Your plan is to anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. The barrel is very roomy. It could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? <sighs> I don't know why I keep letting you hide me inside things. Because it works. It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. We'll dig in Perkin Dutch. Uh, yes, yes, all yours. Take, take. Buster Moriga. No, no, no. Uh, that's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadama tat, more big nich borso. Ow! You can't do this, Miko. No. His plan actually worked.
can not believe it. We are saved. Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai. That was amazing. Kenji, you suck his thrilling piece of monkey dung. I'll handle this. Explain yourself. I might have sold the Mongols food, but given them straw and wood chips instead. To make a profit? To save the farmer's food. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was punishment, hostages. Give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, 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 you were wrong, Lord Takai. I can't do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord. You're damn lucky that samurai spared you, Kenji. I'm sorry, Taro. I was trying to help. You want to help? Choke on a rice ball. I can tell you don't want to talk about this right now. Goodbye, Taro. Set yourself on fire and mate with a Mongol bomb. I thought they killed Lord Shimura. After everything he's done for me, everything he taught me, I can't lose my uncle. I won't. The Kishi grasslands. Straw hat mercenaries were seen in the area. up ahead. Trying to get away from his attackers. Scarecrow, you've looked better too. <laughs> Can I have my hat? 
You're a mercenary now. A professional warrior. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for your leader. He died on Komodo Beach. You were there too. I lost a lot of friends. We all did. And we can avenge them if we work together. Help me save Lord Shimura. He is alive. The straw hats are hurt. Starving. I can't ask them to risk their lives for one man. Even if you can name your price? Once we free our home, Lord Shimura will pay you anything you want. My men might be interested. Your men? I look out for them. Someone has to. Do we have a deal? I'll think about it. Ready? Hold your ground. I always do. This is for Komodo Beach. Kill them all! Bastards won't give up. Don't let them surround us. improved. You managed to grow a beard. Have you considered my offer? The straw hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food, and I'm returning to my men empty-handed. But not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. Sura! Come on. When was the last time we saw each other? Two summers ago. Lord Nagao's tournament. I looked for you after the tournament ended. Straw Hat saw our duel. They needed a new sword. Seemed like fun. Why didn't you tell me you were at Komoda? You were busy with the other samurai lords. I was sharing a drink with my men. I could have used a drink before that battle. Yeah, I'll bet. Another wagon. Might have something we can salvage. Empty. Samurai! Samurai! <clears throat> Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. Hey I'm 
meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? He can declare the Straw Hearts a samurai clan, and make you their lord. On an island, conquered by Mongols. He will drive them out. Your name will appear in the Shogun's official records. You really believe that? I believe it's worth fighting for. I've always been a dreamer. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Komodo Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. But it's starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half, but still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. You have an idea? The beginning of one. Easy, Shinzo. It's me. He's here! You use those back! About time. I don't see any food. Ben, this is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Yuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the straw hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. You better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. <laughs> You're not as handsome as me, but it's not bad. We should check the fort's defenses. Look for weak spots. My men will handle that part. Then we have a deal? Get us that food at the Fort Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just remember who's in charge of the straw hats. I would never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. See you there. Moving out. I meant to ask you something earlier. I might have an answer. How'd you survive the invasion? I almost didn't. A peasant pulled me from the battlefield. She nursed me back to health. <laughs> you always were lucky. How did you and your men escape? We ran. Do what you need to prepare. I'll see you at the old cemetery. Strengthen your armor, my lord. Ah, 
You need more to make these improvements. Farewell. I'm proud to help a true warrior. It's cruel. I used to visit that shrine. Lord Sakai, come quickly. Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farmstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as head man, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. He must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake. But his brother, Hachi, is a fool. He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. We have to go, or we will lose him. After what happened at the inn, I didn't think you'd visit the temple again. I came to watch for Sadao's brother, and mourn Clan Adachi's dead. Have you given your family a proper funeral? Not while their killers walk free. After my father died, I said goodbye to him that same night. It helped ease my pain. I buried them. That will have to do. When's the last time you slept, or ate? I had some rice and fish. Yesterday. Even the youngest warrior needs a full belly and a rested sword arm. Are you calling me old, Lord Sakai? <laughs> I wouldn't dare. My sword arm works just fine. We should have caught up to Hachi by now. Which way do you think you went? Both roads look traveled. Let's search the area. He can't be far. He's leaving. And we will follow. Close, but out of sight. Behave yourself, Ringo. Or no carry for you when you're done. We can't let them see us. Food? Water? Other things? Sure. Uh, of course. You will promise, sir. Not yet, but I have something for your guests. It's a meeting. We'll pass it along. He handed them a note. I'll stop here again at the usual time. We'll meet you now. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses. That man is an idiot. He's the headman's brother. Still an idiot. But he has good sake. Not today. Today, Omi, it was a note. 
That node is more important than your life. If we fail to deliver, the headman will kill us. So those are family. <laughs> From a bad family. His cousins are bandits. Remember the riots that erupted when Kuta Farmstead was sold on rice? Yes. Who do you think hired the bandits that slaughtered the protesters? Headman Sadao. The coward. I knew it. Right. So next time you think of the headman, remember the Kuta massacre. Losing them. house, guarded by bandits. Sadar's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Are you cowards? Corpses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them talk. Let me try first. <laughs> I'm not going to hurt you. My name is Sakai. Who are you? Hina, Sada's wife. My husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. She can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. She's going to kill me. No harm will come to you. You're going to 
going to be all right. What a relief. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Go and stay safe. I'd be honored if you had this. Lord Sakai. Lady Masako, has the traitor's wife told you where he's hiding? Every time I ask, she starts crying and won't look at me. Can you blame her? I'm starting to. Maybe a young samurai will charm her. She's inside. <sighs> Wait here. Hachi delivers messages for your husband. That means they have contact. It's only a matter of time until Masako finds them both. No, you have to save him. I can only do that if I get to him before she does. You know your husband. Where would he hide? Let me think. This is important, Hina. Your husband murdered innocents. I'll be back. Well? I'm giving her time to think about where he might be. What did you offer her? Let's take a walk. I know a place she won't hear us. I told Hina I would try to save her husband's life. You know I'm going to kill him. I had to gain her trust somehow. So you lied. I told her I would try to save him. And I will. What will you tell her when you fail, Jin? That you cannot forgive his crime. And that I will not stand between you and justice. Everywhere I look here, I see only the night my family died. <laughs> You had a family before you married Lord Adachi. Could you go to them? My older brother died a few years ago. And my sister, the assassins butchered her. The only thing I recognized was her gold sash. I didn't mean to make you relive that day. It never leaves my mind. There should be music. What? My grandchildren would make songs with me here to celebrate the changing of the seasons. I will never hear them play again. Thank you. We need her killer. Now. Better look around. They must have left the trail. This way. Why would someone kill Hina? To keep us from finding Sadao. The traitors knew we had her. It was 
was a long journey from the woodcutter. Many people saw her with me. You made sure they did. You used her as bait. I hoped her husband would take it. You should have told me your plan. So you could stop me? I promised to protect her. set of tracks. Whoever the killer is, they're alone. With Hina gone, we need them alive. Hey. Hachi, Sadao's brother. Why did you kill Hina? Tried to free her. She wouldn't leave. Wanted to save Sadao. She screamed for you. I, I didn't mean to. Where's your brother? I failed him. I won't betray him. Tell me where he is! He's gone. No. Hina died for nothing. She was murdered by traitors, just like my family. I can't give up the hunt. He carried messages for his brother. Maybe he had one. What did you find? A map of supply routes. He delivered food to survivor camps. Maybe Sadao is hiding at one. Go to the nearest camp and talk to the monk in charge. He might know what the map reveals. What about you? I will bury Hina. I owe her that. I'll find you at the camp when I'm done. Much better protection. Goodbye. <laughs> 